I'm Brian Westbrook with GeekWire Studios here at AWS reInvent 2024, chatting now with the Chief Product Officer for Datadog, Yanbing Li. Thank you so much for joining us. How's the show been for you? Well, thank you for having me, uh, Brian. The show has been really invigorating. You know, I'm excited to see all the amazing product announcements that's coming out of you know, AWS and other organizations. I'm excited to see all the customer interactions we've had. So it's been, uh, in a, been a great event for us. And I'm really glad you're here joining us. I want to ask you, how has Datadogs advanced its AI ML and AWS monitoring capabilities over the past year? Yeah, that's a that's a great question. You know, we have been a strategic partner for AWS. You know, thinking about reInvent, uh, you know, Datadog is a 14-year-old company, but we've been to 12 reInvent in the past, you know, 12 years. So, uh, we, and we've really seen the event grow and seen the Datadog customer base grow. So, the uh, our relationship with uh, AWS, you know, we serve a lot of joint customers but the success of our customers really come from our deep integrations with AWS. You know, we have more than 100 integration points with the different product and services that AWS offers. That's what, uh, you know, allow us to unlock, you know, all that uh, joint customer uh, success. But, you know, you ask the questions about the AI ML. Uh, you know, you probably have been paying attention to, you know, all the AI ML announcement coming out of uh, AWS, and we have deep integration with all of those things. You know, take example of their new uh, AI chips in, uh, you know, Trinium and in Frenchia. And we have monitoring solution that allow, you know, our joint customers to have deep insight in the those ML chips, how they're performing and how they're being utilized. You probably heard about their announcement around Amazon Q. You know, Datadog, um, you know, we serve a lot of the customers, but now with Amazon Q, we're providing a natural language based uh, way for our customers to interact and query Datadog. In a SageMaker, again, that's a way to enable, you know, data scientists to, you know, do um, ML model development and training, and we provide monitoring to those jobs. And uh, Batarock, uh, again, you know, the, uh, a set of foundational model powering Batarock, and we have visibility into how these models are being used, how they're performing, how the APIs are using. So, yeah, all set of, you know, API, uh, all set of uh, AI ML uh, integration with those AWS capabilities. Well, talk to me for a moment about Datadog's modern approach to cloud SIEM. How does that differ from traditional offering? And when I say SIEM, of course, security, information, event management. How does your approach differ from others? Yeah, that's a great question. You know, Datadog uh, started as an observability company, but we've expanded our offering to be an observability and security platform. And the reason we're getting into security is because we see security is really just another side of the, the coin of observability. You can't secure what you cannot observe. So, so taking into the cloud sim area, you know, the traditional approach has a lots of different silos. There's team silos, you know, the, the people uh, managing uh, those sim capabilities tend to be a highly specialized separate teams. There is technology and tooling silos. There is the data source silos. And you know, our modern and integrated approach is really providing uh, real-time insight into threats, but also coupled with deep observability into your production uh, environment. And I think breaking down those silos of how the teams are working together to solve observability and security problem, you know, how we bring all the data sources together so that you not only have very good insight, you can take action on those insights. You know, that is what we call the, the modern cloud sim approach that we're building. I love that, and you have a deep and dedicated observability support for MongoDB. What does that mean for your customers? Yeah, so if uh, you're a customer, you know, your application not only have the application itself, you know, it often uh, work with databases. And the traditional database monitoring is, your application performance monitoring is here, your database monitoring is again, highly specialized. So that creates a problem, again, you don't have end-to-end -end visibility of the end user application that you're serving. So, um, you know, with our database monitoring, again, taking that theme of breaking down the silo, you know, we allow our customers to see their database performance together with their application performance. So these two teams are not just ping-ponging and finger-pointing where 
the uh, the production issue comes from. So uh, certainly, you know, MongoDB being a leading uh, document database provider, we work with them, uh, and we work with uh, Mongo, but also other uh, popular databases, including Postgres, uh, SQL uh, Server, MySQL, uh, Oracle, uh, et cetera, and with the goal of providing end-to-end -end visibility to our customers' uh, application, you know, including their databases. This is all fantastic. I have one last question for you, and that is, what's next? What is Datadog working on for the next year? Yeah, we are, uh, you know, working uh, to continue to advance, you know, all of our core uh, observability offering. This is, you know, where we, uh, you know, uh, we have a, the largest our uh, customer base, but already trying to extend that, you know, into the adjacent areas to break down those silo. We talk about uh, security, and we are also working on extending that into, uh, you know, real application, uh, real user uh, monitoring, and to product analytics, and also shifting left, because, you know, often what we care about is not just your production environment, but it's also how you develop your application. So, so we're also working on CI/CD visibility, and all of those are also powered by our approach to work uh, AI ML. We integrate AI and ML into every element of what we do. And something that's also very exciting for me personally is, you know, taking all our deep observability and security experience and integrate it with incident management because ultimately our customer wants faster resolution to their incidents. So how we uh, uh, provide you know, better on-call support, incident management to tie everything together. So many exciting things we're working on. I love that, and bringing it together and making it easier for the teams to talk to each other and to monitor and to support incidents. That's absolutely fantastic. Thank you yeah. so much for joining me. Yanbing Lee, Chief Product Officer for Datadog. I'm Brian Westbrook, Geekwire Studios. Thanks for watching.